right, let's take a look at this hot rod. 1951 Mercury Coupe. Beautiful car in black. And as you can see, check it out right on those wide whites. That red highlight on the rim. Nice looking wheel covers. And come right down to a little bit of a James Dean mural and the Rebel insignia on there. What a cool old school hot rod look this has. Come around to the front. Everybody loved about the 51 Mercs. That big chrome grill, bumper, bright work, everything up on the front. As you can see, this has been highlighted with some pinstriping. Set off above the center Mercury logo and the headlights on up to the hood ornament. Give this thing a great old school hot rod look. Check out the still pictures. You want to see what it looks like underneath the car, interior, engine bay, any of that? Please feel free. Check out the still pictures, uniqueclassiccars.com. And of course, we can be called at 507 386 1726. I'd call this a high end of a driver quality paint. As you can see, the paint's got a nice shine to it, nice luster. This right here. Is just something that was on the hood. It's not a chip or anything. It's a little piece of lint or rag or something there. Come and take a look down the side of this car. See how nice and straight it is. Again, you can see the reflection coming off of it. Light, light pipes, and they are plumbed into the exhaust. The matching James Dean and Rebel. Little mural over here but again you know when you look up and down a black car and it's not straight it really shows this car see how nice and straight it is the bright work is also in nice shape not full of you know little dings or nicks or imperfections in it any sort of pitting anything like that bright work is nice on this car interior is kind of kept stock look with the cloth in it bent seats come around to the rear see the dual exhaust coming out the back uh, this car does have a flathead in it, so you get a flathead V8 like it should have underneath there. That's paired with a manual transmission on the column. Again, a little larger, a little more dominant pinstriping on the rear deck lid because of the size of the trunk. Just everything fits so nicely on this car. Giving it that, that look that was very, very popular with hot rodding. Again, look up and down the side of this. You can see the reflection. See how straight it is. See how nice the door fits. Again, bright work. Not pitted. Not dinged. It's what a great looking car. Once again, check out the still pictures. You want to spend a little time looking at the pictures. And like I said, the underneath, the trunk, the interior. Check out those still pictures. UniqueClassicCars.com. Now, we do consider trades. Financing is available. And we can assist you with the transportation to where you're located at. Feel free to call us, 507-386-1726. We're going to go ahead and take a look at this interior. Like I said, cloth bench seat in it. Rubber floors. Again, kind of keeps the original vibe of the interior look going here. The kind of old school hot rod on the outside. We're going to fire this up too so you can hear it running. Great starting and running car. Headliner all in good shape. Check out the seats. Free of much wear. Tears or any sort of rips. Anything like that. Let's go ahead and fire this up. Turn the key on. Starter's off to the left. See how easily that starts. Did have the wipers working earlier. The wipers worked fine. Nice little rumble out of that flatty. Good sounding car. Just slip around in the back. Like I said, the lake pipes are plumbed in. They are capped off right now. So we just got that old school flatty sound out of the dual exhaust in the rear. I'm going to go ahead and pause this video a second because it takes a little bit to get the hood open this size gonna need more than one hand here so give me a second let's take a look at the engine bay all right previous owner has a couple notes on here too little one right here don't slam the hood just put them down gently due to the size of the hood with the springs and everything 
and then on the inside make sure you take there is a hood release on the inside of this which I'll show you in case you need to refer to it in the future there is a hood release right down here in the 51 Mercs and there's also a tag on that make sure that's pushed all the way in before you go to close the hood too and then just close it gently, gently. all right so there's that flathead v8 underneath there dual carb setup as you can see this engine bay nice and tidy see how smooth that flathead runs what you kind of expect out of a stock mercury look underneath the hood pretty cool hot rod 1951 mercury cool Give us a call, 507-386-1726. Of course, those still pictures can be seen at uniqueclassiccars.com. We do consider trades, financing is available, and of course, we can assist you with the transportation to where you're located at. Give us a call.